wanted to pop in here and give you a really quick tour of my foyer or my entryway to show you all of the things that I had showed you in my haul and where I placed those items for my January haul. As soon as you come through the door, you'll enter into the foyer area and you'll see this little um, lantern here that I had purchased at Joanne Fabrics. Uh, I just placed it on top of this little table stand and I put two candle holders next to it. This mirror that we're looking at is just 50 of the Dollar Tree individual mirrors that were glued together on the back of a board. Um, it's kind of a DIY hack from the Pottery Barn uh, mirrors that they have. A lot of people have done about 20 mirrors. I seem to like to do things a little bit larger. I'm not from Texas, but I'll do them big. Um, and I put 50 mirrors together. And this is kind of what that looks like from this angle. I really, really like these mirrors. And originally I just did it for Christmas, but then I left it up there. So I partnered again the two um, candlesticks that I had already had put a candle and some greenery inside of the lantern and then just tied a ribbon on the side of it. Not quite sure how I want to decorate the top of that yet, but this is what it looks like so far. And you'll see that I also put the medium sized lantern with a uh, floral arrangement inside of it, partnered it up with this table. So that's the look as soon as you come into the room. And I'll give you a look at it from this angle when you're standing in the living room. This is what you'll see. It's kind of hard because it's so close up, but that's... All right, and then we move over and the next thing you'll see here is the vase that I had purchased from Pier 1. This vase is a um, metallic silver and gold and it is beautiful. I found it on the clearance. I just partnered it with a floral bouquet, multiple colors, because in my home, most of the things are kind of a neutral color, so I can give it pops of color here and there. The themes are uh, brass, nickel, gold, and browns is what you'll see a lot of. So adding these pops of color don't hurt it and it doesn't overpower anything. This stand is standing right next to, again, a brown mirror, which is, you know, the Queen Anne style is kind of my thing. I'm moving away from it a little bit, but I think mirrors add a lot of volume to a room. It opens the room up. This wall looks like it's white, but it's really a color called marshmallow, and it is um, real clean to me. Now, this is an awesome find that I found at Amazon. I purchased it and it finally came in yesterday so I put the legs on it and put it up and I thought now my tour is ready to be um, shot and put online I really like this little bench it's it was hundred and nineteen dollars if I'm not mistaken from Amazon it's real really really comfortable actually and I partnered it with the large lantern that I showed you in the hall a couple weeks ago I'll leave a link to that I partnered this this chair or bench with this large lantern and placed it right here in the hallway. So this is what the room looks like if you're coming out of the kitchen into the hallway foyer area. And these rugs I had already had, I purchased at Myers, and they actually, again, my neutral colors, but they fit in this room and they tie everything together really nicely. I don't know why my camera keeps trying to focus in and out, but we're all focused. So this is what it looks like. It looks clean. I'm a less is more type of girl in some areas. And since we have so much company that comes in and out of this room, I don't have a lot of bling. I don't have a lot of stuff in the area um, that would require me to have to do a lot of dusting all the time. I think it looks nice the way that it is. Hey, hey y'all. All right, and the last thing that I want to show you, or actually I want to show you this clock. We, I bought this clock probably from the um, Dollar General, if I'm not mistaken, but it fits nice with the little theme. I am trying to break away from some of the brown, so I may put some uh, throw pillows, maybe some silver gold on the um, chair, so that'll give that a little bit of bling and color there. But last but not least, my mirrors. You remember these mirrors I found on clearance at Hobby Lobby? 
I ended up placing them at the end of the stairway. So here's what it looks like if I'm standing at the top of the stairs. You see these full mirrors that I made out of Dollar Tree plates and they're kind of at the top of my stairway. And then as you walk down, I place the mirrors here at the end of the stairway and they just kind of fill this space in with a little bit of bling, a little bit of reflection from the mirror. And once the light hits them, they are so pretty. I really like these mirrors. What do you guys think? Why don't you leave me a comment, subscribe to my page, make sure you turn on the notifications button so you can see the next um, video that's posted. Here's one more look at the room standing at the door. Why don't you tell me what you think? Leave me your comments. Thanks for watching.